Keyviz is a very useful tool that shows the keystrokes on the screen, and it does that very well. You can see the keys appear along the bottom of the screen, and there's an animation to show repeated keystrokes, and you can change the style and appearance of the keys in a variety of ways. I have some tips on how you can put Keyviz into your OBS scenes. One thing I noticed, if you're to zoom in, you may miss the keystrokes if your zoom portion of the screen is above where the keys appear, you won't see them. So let me show you how you can load Keyviz into OBS and put the display wherever you would like it in your scene. First thing we're going to do is click on the settings for Keyviz. Right click on the Keyviz icon and bring up the settings menu. Configure the style and appearance however you'd like and switch the menu to Appearance. Now we're going to add it as a game capture source. So go to the plus sign, clip capture, game capture source. OK. Change the mode to capture specific window. Choose the Keyviz settings. Choose allow transparency and uncheck the other two. Don't close this menu until a preview of the settings appear. You may have to focus on the settings menu for it to show up. In this case it showed up straight away. In the past I've had to click on it before it appears. Click OK. Now if you have two screens just move the settings off to the second screen so it doesn't appear in your recording area if you're recording full screen. If you only have one screen, you can use the shortcut Alt Space to first maximize the settings menu and then Alt Space again to minimize the settings. Now the keys won't appear on your screen, but they will appear in your scene. So let's trim our window so we don't see the additional settings information, just the area where the keys appear. And now we can have the game capture area placed anywhere in our scene that we would like. And it can display the various shortcut keys that you would use during your demonstration. And if you don't want the keys to appear, you can make it invisible on your scene or set a hotkey so it doesn't appear in your stream. To bring the Keyviz settings menu back, go to the task manager and right click on the key settings and click bring to front. And now the maximize window is back. And you can further edit your style, and again, to send it back, you would then minimize it to continue. Thank you to the developer for creating this very useful tool. Look forward to using it in future demonstrations. I think it'll enable a lot of potential. Thank you very much. Take care.